Hello ladies and gentlemen, Blank Check here, and at last, a reaction to Equestria Girls 4 Legend of Everfree. When did this come out? October 1st? Eh, October, December, I'm practically on time. This film was written by Christine Sonko and Joanna Lewis, who helped bring us Castle Sweet Castle, Gauntlet of Fire, Top Bolt, The Hooffields and McColts, and Rarity Investigates. That is an interesting lineup, and I look forward to seeing how their talents translate over to film. I saw the trailer months back, I know the group are heading over to Camp Everfree, run by Gloriosa Daisy and Timber Spruce. And there is a story about Gaia Everfree, an urban legend about the spirit of the forest. Though it may not be a legend, because it seems the campers are assaulted at some point by a magical creature, it might be Gaia, it might not. If it is, I'm thinking maybe she's not evil, and if it's not, my money is on Gloriosa, the very cheery camp counselor. Perhaps a Scooby-Doo-esque story, as I brought up in my trailer reaction. So the first Equestria Girls was middling, Rainbow Rocks was pretty great, and Friendship Games was a little too ambitious for its time budget. Let's see where Legend of Everfree can land. Alrighty then. Twilight Sparkle, Human Twilight Sparkle, no, and Dog Spike. Can't be. It isn't true. In her cool little bedroom. Twilight. All right, Twilight's having nightmares. Oh no 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 no! I can't believe I overslept. I'm late for a very important date. Me neither. That's not like you. All right, all the gang's all here. I know. Don't you have a super annoying alarm clock that goes? Eh, eh. <laughs> oh, there it is. It's gonna be fine. We'll help you pack. I know that feeling. I put my phone under my pillow. Uh, Was that a picture of Rainbow Dash? In the woods. When's she gonna need that? That she just threw in there. The moon. I'd insist she packed an evening gown. One never knows, darling. That's kind of great. Let me just get changed. <laughs> you can change right here, right in front of us. No, who cares? Oh. Oh, I thought she was just in the mirror. Sunset Shimmer helped me defeat you at the friendship games. You and your friends can never This is too fast. This is a <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> They're being digitized. Midnight Sparkle's a part of you. Are we going on a Digimon adventure? Be there, waiting in the darkest shadows of your mind. Oh, oh boy. Along with the number one trophy, I see. Stop until I have all the magic. No! No! Twilight, wake up! Oh, okay, all right. Nightmare confirmed. Oh, Lyra Bonbon! Yeah! Hey, are you okay? Huh, I'm fine. Right off the bat. We are gonna have so much fun! We're gonna roast marshmallows and eat marshmallows and sleep on marshmallow pillows! <laughs> yeah, and be marshmallows? Rarity's, uh, like, way ahead of us on that point. Attention, students! We're yeah, this was in the trailer. But before we arrive, we just wanted to say how proud we are of you for raising enough money yep, to on the bus. on class field trip. When we were your All right. age, we made some of our favorite memories in these woods, and we're sure you can <laughs> now. Who's A lot of our teenage experimentation happened right here in these woods. Right in camp, where you'll be staying. All right. Yeah! Field trip, those are always fun. That's a lie. Alright, oh, title card! I think I've heard this tune. Was this in the trailer? This is cool. Oh no, an orange truck. Applejack is swearing like a sailor as they pass that. I like having an intro song like this. Yeah, okay, I know. Yeah, this is the like the main sort of song. I've heard it somewhere. Not the full thing, but the tune and the chorus. Yep, Christine Sonko, Joanna Lewis. See how you girls do. Oh dear! Alright. You have this like purple 
smoke monster following us. I don't know if that's like Midnight Sparkle. Or we're having a crossover with Lost. That'd be great. Camp Everfree. Terra Strong as Twilight Sparkle. Yep, good old Rebecca. Sunset coming back once more. Ashley Ball as Rainbow Rainbow and Apple Apple. Andrew Lidman as Pinkie Pie and Best Pony. Miss St. Germain as Madame Rarity. Kathy as Spike the Dog. Because we don't like Kathy. Right, okay. Adams as Gloriosa Daisy. Doe as Timber Spruce. Right, that's the green-haired guy. <laughs> Spike likes the taste of the window. I would have really enjoyed if Pinky also licked the window. I think that would have been a nice touch. Okay, so we have like this purple glittery thing. I don't know if that's an actual thing happening or not. Isn't Camp Everfree just beautiful? Yeah, vinyl and bonbon. Until we have our first nature walk. I definitely want to go. Nice hairstyle. Place. You want to see all the adorable whipping creatures too? Yeah. <laughs> specifically squirrels. More specifically, so I can chase them. Wow. Well, I'm a dog. That's the joke. Make my own shelter, forage for food. Uh, you know they provide us with food and tents, right? Yep. I, Still gonna forage though. Applejack is way too intense for being intense. Here has all been a bit too much for my taste. Yeah, that's gonna be one of these reactions, guys. I'm sorry. Sirens who tried to hypnotize everybody with their singing, one ridiculously competitive rival school, and two demon friends. Uh, no offense. Yes, yes. They brought no offense back, and now it's doubly effective. It's gonna be nice getting away to a place where we don't have to worry Trixie about Trixie and Octavia are talking. They're best friends now. Thanks. It's Flash, right? Brad! Yep. That's me. And you're you. And we don't know each other very well. Very good, Brad. Cool story, bro. Right. <laughs> I guess I'll see you around. You'll get there eventually, Brad. Who looks just like you when she's here, but lives in another dimension, and she's a pony princess? Uh-huh. Flash <laughs> kind of had a thing for her. Oh. That's good exposition. Just Hi, quick and to if the point. Start heading to the courtyard. That would be rad. It's time to start the best. Oh man. Ever. It'd be rad. Brad knows rad. Everyone, welcome to Camp Everfree. I'm Gloriosa Daisy, your camp director. Think of me. <laughs> camp and nature guide. And this is my brother, Timber. She just walked off the set of Fargo to come here. Who should always be invited to fun things? We aim to please, so before we hand out... I don't know what he's doing. We'd like to hear from all of you. You're free to do whatever you like here. Yeah, as long as it's legal. That's off limits. Yes, but otherwise your options are wide open. An off-limits place. will make this the very best week of your lives ever. How long until we go there? Done. Archery. Of course. Yeah. Naturally. Rainbow... I know you're excited, but maybe... Satanic rituals! Absolutely! Crush. My mom needs new pot holders. Oh, Ritualistic oh, sacrifice oh, of children! Oh, I do make a mean sugar cookie. Early oh my god. Walks with Aww. For everyone. Yeah, well, walking sticks. Uh, a fashion show where I design the most fabulous camp looks inspired by today's hottest trends and have them modeled by my class. Oh my god. A camp tradition! <laughs> we have literally never done that. <laughs> I'll be taking requests the rest of the time you're here, so if there's anything you'd like to do, anything you need, just. Oh no. What about the camp gift? Oh that no. Is my favorite camp ever free tradition. The that blush. Gift, of course! Really? Yes, really. Well, I just thought. Oh, look at that smile. Anyone else picking up on a little tension between Gloriosa and her brother? Yeah. yeah. Little. And <laughs> here, campers work together to create Honestly. a gift for future campers. Working toward this common goal is key to forming the strong bonds that will last well beyond your time here at camp. Yeah. Which is why it's so important. Strong like hydrogen bonds. Gift from last year's group. Oh, 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 and the totem pole and the sundial were also made by campers. And this pentagram. Our year's gift. <clears throat> Even though some people thought it was a little impractical since a sundial can't be used at night. 
<laughs> oh! You all seem oh! Like a, a she's really such a Luna! Group. So I'm certain you'll come up with something inspiring to leave behind. That's great, Celestia had to make a sundial. I like it. Now's the time when we give out tent assignments, so you can leave your heavy bags behind. <laughs> this guy. Their assignments from Timber. I don't like him. With me. All right. Gloriosa is so evil. Like, when is when is that turn gonna happen? Aquamarine. Me too. Yeah, we can put Ashley in the same tent with Ashley. Sapphire. Me too. Fluttershy and Vinyl. Assuming I am. Technically, sapphires aren't just blue. I can work with that pairing. Pink, purple, yellow. Yeah, but they're mostly blue. That's why they're named after the Latin word spherus. Like my. <laughs> nope. Never mind. It's blue. I know. But did you know that sapphires are just rubies without chromium? No. Oh my god. But did you know that sapphire tent? Oh no. No. Why Is he that? Flash 2.0? Because you're in it. Oh. <laughs> okay, I bet you say that to all the campers. Oh Not true. Oh no. You're in the ruby tent? Oh that no. That's the worst one. Oh man. <laughs> I'm just joking, buddy. Ruby tent is great. It's like a sapphire, but with chromium. Oh boy. Oh boy. I'm... But the ruby and coral tints do look an awful lot alike to the undiscerning eye. I don't know how much of this guy I can handle. See you around. Adios. Waifu. <laughs> Nothing. Oh god, no. Adorable. Don't do this to me. Not not all, not this fast. We'll be meeting at the docks in 15 minutes to go over some camp safety rules. Who is that cat? I need anything. <laughs> I need oh. Filthy rich. So nice. Oh, it is. To see you. Okay, that's what are you doing here? really interesting. Just getting started. Just taking in the scenery, Gloriosa Daisy. It's so wow, <laughs> relaxing. Well, Alec is his model. Over. Now, if you don't mind. Oh man, we have a Five. animosity between the camp counselor and Mr. Rich. Mr. Rich is uh, an alumni of the camp. He likes to check on his old stomping grounds every now and again. But enough about him. We totally well, believe you. Put away your things. We've got the best week of camp ever. To We're begin. sure nothing's wrong. All right. <sighs> I'm all for learning safety rules, but I do hope I can get safety to rules for the camp fashion show sooner rather than later. I love my clarinet. Let me wave it in the in the air. Fashion show. We're in the middle of the woods for crying out loud. We're supposed to be roughing it. It's clear from yeah. the house's own wardrobe that we're supposed to get dirty. Well put together look, even if we are in the middle of the woods. I'm sweaty. Fair enough. Just as long as you don't put me in one of your fancy pants outfits. Oh, Fluttershy and Vinyl. You're gonna, aren't you? No. They're having a chat. Don't worry, darling. It will absolutely speak to your personal sense. Ooh. That was oh, such a cute there, smile. Right? That guy, filthy rich. Huh? Oh. But the animation for this is. I just have this. And the, the models are so much better. Something. Her brother is pretty cute, though, huh? Than the first one. He's okay. Ooh, now look who's trying to hide something. Oh my god. No, you, we don't even- you You're just okay. met him. He seemed a little freaked out on the bus earlier. Probably had another one of her nightmares. I know you have no worldly experience, Twilight, but- I mean, what do I have to complain about? Ever since I transferred here, everyone from CHS has been really nice and accepted. You're not Ariel, don't- Especially considering what happened at the- Fall in love just because- That wasn't your fault. He's new. Prince is the one who encouraged you to try and use all that magic to win the games for Crystal Prep. You weren't ready to have that kind of power. But it's over now. And if there's any group that yeah. can forgive you for something that happened in the past, trust me, it's this one. Yeah, I like Hi, supportive what? sunset. Right there. She's great. I just want to put on some sunscreen. Huh. Sunscreen for sunset. Found it. So she won't shimmer too much. That, that, that's new. Yeah, I saw the, in the trailer it showed that she was. Did you? How is this possible? Magicking up a storm. It's amazing. amazing. Spike's just taking it in stride. Are you kidding? This is great. I mean, we've all ponied up before, gotten the whole ear. Uh, 
shot magical rainbow lasers. We're still going with that, huh? This ever happened? How did you do it? I don't know. Maybe I didn't. Maybe it's her. I just got real uh, funny no. feelings for Timber Spruce. Thing, never mind. Can we just not talk about it? And could you please not bring this whole levitating thing up to the others? And then the magic Why went not? everywhere. You heard Applejack. This is supposed to be a place where everyone can get away from magic. I don't want them to know I brought some crazy new kind with me. And then I was like, I really Wingardium Leviosa. I really don't. Okay, but this isn't necessarily a bad thing. Oh, good. Nice. Nice audio work there. Closing the flap of the tent. <sighs> <laughs> You're just gonna have to pick it up. No sunscreen, I command you. What if sunset's magic is to make everything explode? Don't act like that. What did you say? I didn't say anything. Just here to make what? sure everyone was headed over to the docks. What just happened? Did you need something? Nope. Because if there is anything I can do to make this week the best week ever, you just let me know. <laughs> I got this. Thanks. Well, there is one thing you could do, Gloriosa. People that chipper make me nervous. This is gonna be so much fun! Agreed. I guess not all people. Aw. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? It looks like a diamond shine. She can endure sun. Pinky's insanity. Lovely out here. The fresh air, the cool breeze. Oh, yeah. The birds that land on your finger. I, I think that that only happens to you. Yeah! Activities are available every day until Tell's in the trailer. So if you want to canoe, sail, windsurf, or swim, just let me know. What about my kayak? Aren't they just the cutest? They look like Whoa. Pegasi. I know I'm charming, but you don't have to fall for me. Oh boy. Oh boy, I... I'm... I... I need to click the the pot the the Guess stop I can't button. Get too jealous, right? After all, she is in my twilight. Not that the other. Oh. Mine, but we were, you know. A little presumptuous, aren't you? I get it, but your twilight is a princess in Equestria. Hate to break it to you. Suck but it. That's where she's gonna spend most of her time. So you're saying <laughs> I just need to get over her? Kinda, yeah. Ouch. You Ouch. Any punches. Not really my style. Sorry. Nice. Harsh hazard. truth sunset. We close down the dock for the remainder of the camp. Oh, 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 I'm sure it won't have to be for the remainder. Bitter reality of the camp. sunset. This needs to be patched up a bit. I've got this. Huh. I've got. Oh. Well, maybe we oh. Bon bon. Ask me. This whole dock needs to go. Always has a shoulder to lean on. Building a new one could be our camp gift. I like it. Benefit us, but a nice new dock would benefit future campers too. I don't know. It's an awful lot of work. I wouldn't All want right. you guys to miss out on doing other fun camp stuff because you're so busy building a dock for future campers. Make this dock. Make this dock. One, I two, three, four. Timber, but we're Canterlot Wonder Colts. We've got a reputation to uphold. Yeah. There was no way we were gonna leave this place without contributing the most awesome camp <laughs> ever. We fight but demonic we villains. A new dock is definitely it. What do you guys think? And build safe structures for which to walk over water. Looks like it's settled then. That's what we're known for. Looks like it. That's some tension, all right. Yeah. Let's just hope it's the right kind of tension. We can reinforce the foundation. Make it since they're brother and sister. And we can add a wood-carved sign that says Camp Everfree. And little boxes of food. You know what I'm saying. And ducks and fishies. Oh, we'll add lanterns so you can see at night. <laughs> We'll make light so you cannot be darkness. And we'll make an absolutely perfect runway for my cat fashion show. Like rainbows. More importantly, it'll be a great place for docking canoes and feeding the wildlife. Mm, you say tomato. Yeah. I say perfect place to showcase glamorous boho chic stylings. What do you guys think? They're almost identical. Work, but we can do it. Yes! Adult supervision! <laughs> Yeah, Hasbro. Nice hammer. Subtly hammer in that, uh, that yeah. more those morals. Huh. That's cool. I made mine. <laughs> oh my God, Derpy! Making oh, out of solar-powered garden lights. I want to see a picture of Derpy carrying the hammer you in her mouth. Crafty. You should see my macaroni art. I'm like the Picasso of noodles. <laughs> oh boy, this guy. Right now. 
You've made a lot of progress. What are we going to do with this guy? Soon. We can pick this up tomorrow between our other camp activities. Everyone get cleaned like, up and we'll gather by the fire pit at 8 to share s'mores. Hopefully he's the villain so we can get rid of him. <laughs> yeah, s'mores. All you need is chocolate graham crackers and Sweetie Belle. She was wearing purple socks with a burgundy dress. Ah! <laughs> I'm terrified. Darlings, the same color family. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, I'm gonna have nightmares. Uh, that was a terrifying story. I won't be able to go yeah. to bed tonight. Terrified you'll try to tell it again. <clears throat> Anyone else have a nice burn? Story? Sick rainbow I'm rash. But I'm warning you, you might as well hug a friend now. That's how scary it is. <laughs> Twilight, hug me real fast. <laughs> it's time I told you about the legend of Gaia Everfree. Hey, here we go. All right. Those trees are being a little droopy. Many years ago, my great grandparents came to this forest. Seeing it's you can tell because the edges are dimmed out. The perfect place for a camp. That it's old timey. But once they started building, strange things started to happen. That, that's not good. Black night, when the wind was howling, a tree branch. It's not that pitch black. From their cabin, they screamed and ran outside, only to see a giant creature rising from the earth. Oh, she that sounds bad. Hair, like the roots of a tree. Her mouth had yeah. jagged rock teeth, and her eyes were like rocks. Tar, but her aura shimmered like diamonds. Anywhere she like went, diamonds. she left a trail of gem dust in her wake, trembling. All right, that's a clue right there. What she wanted. In a deep and hollow that gem dust will come up later. That her name was Gaia Everfree, an ancient spirit who held domain over the forest, and that my great grandparents yeah. were trespassing on her land. All right, they all right. Her to let them stay and build their camp to share this wonderful place with others. Yeah, I like how Gaia Everfree finally agreed, but warned them that they would not be able to keep it forever. Some day all right. she would return. <laughs> They walk away sexily. Sway those hips. Dust, you'll know that it is. I like how the uh, the grandparents. Oh jeez. Hey guys. <laughs> hey, didn't mean to scare you. Looked like Loriosa and Why Timber. The bushes. I took the scenic route because the forest is beautiful at night. Yep. All right. But no one else should do it without a guide, okay? I was definitely not All in those. Right, everybody. Time to head to your tents. That off limits place we mentioned earlier. Do you have extra toothbrushes? I forgot mine. No. Oh. Sure do. I'll get one for you. I need to clean my my two teeth that I have. Flashlights. Of course. <laughs> I got this. I got this. It's like a is that her catchphrase. Sorry, Spike. I guess that story got to me. Why? Also, I really wanted to strangle you. Oh, Gaia Everfree could be some creature that got booted from Equestria and ended up in this world. That's what happened yeah. with the sirens. Eh, sounded more like something that Timber was making up just to scare us. That's kind of a logical conclusion. I hope it was. Last thing I Based on the world Tamper they're living in. Power crazed magical creature. Oh, here, here. We've had to deal with more than our fair share of those. At the fall formal, our musical showcase, <laughs> our friendship game. No offense. Uh, I mean, you know, uh, everything turned out all right, of course. <laughs> I'm kind of tired. I'm going to turn in. Maybe lay off bringing up what happened at the French <laughs> Games. I think she's still pretty sensitive about it. Why would she be? Our lips are sealed. Oh, my God. Okay. All right. Pinky, you're going to just get diabetes by the end of this movie. Yeah, I am. I'm afraid for your health. Over here. Alright, back to Nightmare Land. I'm always here. No! Always. Nothing. Sorry, Sunset. Damn you, Hyde. Uh, Twilight, I think something happened. Yeah! No, no, it's always like that, I think. Nothing out of the ordinary it's here. Time to get up already. Twilight, we really have to I feel like Spike this. would sleep through the apocalypse. We don't. If he had the opportunity. 
Alright. Oh. That's <laughs> so adorable. Hey. Alright. I know you don't want to, but I really think we need to figure out what's going on with your magic. If you could learn that, to control it. That seems like a pretty I'll never be able to control it. Reasonable thing. Oh. Oh no, Derby! What happened? Derby I overboard! Didn't mean to. We didn't see anything, so we don't know what happened. Okay. The question is, Are did no Twilight way? do that or yeah. not? It was so weird. We were stuck in the middle of the lake with no wind. Then all of a sudden, bam! Then all of a sudden, the up and we were pushed right into the dock. There was wind. <gasps> you don't think it was this? It's like you? nature's crazy, man. It was me. Spirit, <laughs> show yourself. The great and powerful skeptical Trixie face was great. I love how she rolls her R's every single time. Bonbon's hair, I really like that. Ruined. At least the fishies are eating well. Let's salvage what we can out of the water. Oh, who went in the lake? Fix this. We have to try. Camp Everfree needs a runway. Who's been eating? Glitter dust. Okay, that was like the 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 gem dust that Gaia has. It used to be so simple. Oh, okay, song, sure. But that's different than Twilight's magic, isn't it? No, and I didn't know, and life seemed pretty good. That was a really but now the darkness quick uh, song transition there. Deep of me. But it looks like uh, Twilight's got a Jekyll Hyde complex going on. All right. I can see with the light, I know I'll Ooh. Free. I like this. I can start to be home. I can start to be me. I like the, the solo songs a lot. They're usually pretty more emotionally packed. Got some good go some goosebumps there. Like the instrumental is really good here. All right, Midnight and Me. That's a nice song. Kind of came out of nowhere. Into the sapphire tent. <laughs> One squirrel, oh, two squirrel, I was having the best dream. three squirrel. Wait, ah, ah, ah. that dream could be a reality. Before you run off to chase squirrels, do you have any idea where Twilight? <laughs> Before could be? you run off to really murder really creatures that Fluttershy is. Did she do that lifting things off the ground thing again? That's just it. I don't know if it was her, but if it was, we need to deal with it head on. Apply directly to the forehead. Keep it together. Deep breaths. You are not a monster. Breathe in, breathe out. Oh. Pony Twilight knows how to do that. What are you doing here? Uh, looking for you. Oh. Smooth. Nature walking. Got a little lost. Let me show you the way. Look at. I'm kind of an expert at these woods. Mr. McSmooth over here. That must have been nice. Growing up at a camp. Yeah. Sweeping so your waifus off their feet. When I was younger, I wished we'd sell this place so we could live in a town like normal people. Really? All right. I was 10. I really wanted to hang out at the mall. I was 10 and stupid. I've never told that to anyone. You must be special. <laughs> and not just because you have a tree branch in your hair. <laughs> Got your nose. Not long. Just the whole time we were talking. <laughs> well, why did you say something? I was waiting for the perfect opportunity. Yes, Twilight deal with the magic stuff a little later. Cause I got the moves. Rock climbing is all about perseverance and trust. Rarity, you can trust that Applejack will spot you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's right there. I spotted her. 
Sorry, I've been waiting to do this since we got here. Well, you'll have to wait a little longer, darling. Yeah, why wasn't Rainbow first? Twilight, if you spot me, I can finally go. I'll go get another harness. I see it right there. It's hard to miss you. Sure. I better make sure my sister doesn't need anything. You have seven colors in your hair. How could I not spot you? Why? Why is the shipping? Twilight, why? There you are. I was looking for you. Twilight, I need you. Is that an earthquake? We aren't near any fault lines. Hey! That didn't what answer my question. Crystally dusty stuff here. <laughs> oh, the gem dust. It's back. I believe I'd like to come down now. Yeah, rock climbing is a, it's a it's tough a thing. <laughs> oh. Oh no! Splattered marshmallow! What are you doing? Is everything okay over there? Uh, I don't know what happened. All right. I didn't even pull the rope that hard. It's like she was light as a feather all of a sudden. You think safety procedures would say to have a padded bottom to that? You get your harness off. No. Oh. Oh yeah. There's her. Her force push. What in the world just happened? <laughs> oh dear. I am so sorry. I think. Did I just do whatever that was? Did I do that? I don't think it was your fault. I'm gonna go get Applejack a towel. I don't know. It seemed like her fault me to too. me. You're not the only one with a new kind of magic. This is great. No, it's not. Yeah. Charity and Applejack could have really hurt each other. You get magic. Why is this happening? And you get magic. Everyone gets magic. Anything I can do for you? Uh, Applejack just fell into the lake. Oh no! Oh no! She's gonna need warm towels, dry clothes, oh, and a hot cocoa. And a nice I'm massage. Dead. I'll deliver it personally. Fluttershy? Oh no, Fluttershy! Save her! What happened? I don't know. We were just decorating cookies and. Bowser! You need more sprinkles and you need more sprinkles! <laughs> oh my god! I'm so stare cookie <laughs> pie stuff. Oh, did they just do the, the Oprah meme? Glowed pink and exploded. What the? Oh, wow. Just like that, only earlier. Okay, why don't you lay off touching stuff for a while? <laughs> we really but I want to touch you, you, Sunset. <laughs> rub, rub, rub. Can someone help me out? Aw. Oh. Thank you, Mr. Bird. That that works. Why, of course I can get you a little something to. <gasps> All right. Do you just talk? But oh. I don't speak chirp. <laughs> well, I don't know if you're the only bird I can understand. Even tweets are making sense now. Oh no! Please don't call for your friend. I forgot. I forgot that she couldn't talk to animals. Like I forgot that wasn't something nice to all of you too. that human fetish I could do. Just talking to the birds. Um. Yes. That's so adorable. Did you tell him what happened? So crazy. Yeah, there's the wet hair Applejack. Up the rock climbing wall like it was nothing. Like I had way more strength than I usually do. And I made which is usually a lot. Thing appear out of nowhere, which normally I'd be excited about. I mean, the facets were just perfect, and the rarity. <laughs> oh, sorry, it knocked Applejack over, and then it disappeared. Speaking of this, a hit and run. Has anybody seen Rainbow Dash? <laughs> I think I found her. Ow! Whoa! How'd you do I think that? she has a broken nose. Oh, no. I started running to get the harness, and the next thing I knew, I was practically back in town. But if you had some sort of super oh. speed, why so Rainbow's the, the Flash off? now. Because I lost it when I got far away, and then it came back when I got close to camp. <gasps> Being at camp is giving us all, all right. new magical abilities. Not all of us. So have within the radius, I haven't. But Twilight of camp. Hasn't the abilities so much for my theory that leaving CHA are a powerful leaving any new magic business behind something at the camp must be making this happen um God yeah ever free <laughs> I'm kind of betting it's gonna be in that well, Jack I was looking for you here I brought you some towels and dry clothes off limits place uh, what, what we mentioned you? earlier we're kind of trying to figure that out well, don't worry about it. I got this. Gloriosa, I got this. I kicked my beanbag into the lake. Oh, tough man. I'll get you another one. And I'm all out of arrows. <laughs> Say no more. New arrows coming right up. What have you done, there Derpy? You Filthy Rich is back. You want me to handle it? What did you do to those arrows? I've got this. 
Fluttershy, enough with the screaming. I didn't scream. Yeah, I don't think that was uh, Fluttershy. Nobody did. Huh? Attention campers. Anyone who's interested in making floating paper lanterns, please meet ooh. us by the picnic table. Ooh, ooh. I don't know about the ooh, it's like tangled. I've been looking forward to coming here for a month. Maybe we forget about this new magic for a bit. And, and at last I, I see the light. I was also excited about the designs I've come up with for the camp fashion show. And I've barely got and it's to like anybody in The sky I has shifted. I it out. But if letting it go for now is what the rest of you want... You just gotta let it go. Let it go. Alright, yeah. Oh, paper lanterns. Everyone's putting their cutie marks on it. Hi, what are you doing? Putting marshmallows in my lanterns. Then when we light them, mine will be beautiful and delicious. <laughs> but who's gonna eat it? Why aren't you with everyone else? Sunset said something at camp is causing the other girls to get new magic. I think it's yeah. a sparkle. She's still part of me. I can feel it. I don't know. Her magic is infecting my friends. What are we gonna do? Infecting, empowering. Okay, ah, potato, potato. It's time to watch your lanterns fly. Yeah. And at last I see the light. Hey, and it's light. Like... Oh, God. My face. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's... That's not a... Uh, you okay? Creepy? You don't seem like yourself tonight. You seem kinda... Midnighty. Ready? And... Go! And it's warm and real and bright. Aww! Oh well, now I get to eat it! <laughs> Beautiful and delicious. <laughs> Just like rarity. Wait, what? No. Oh, oh, I saw that. I saw that. Twilight's Lantern bumped McSmooths. Oh, you people. You animators. You're, you're killing me here. Twilight! Where is she going? Sparkle's out of here. Sparkle's bailing. Twilight? No, I am what not Twilight. What are you doing out here? We're... We're meeting a cab to take us home. I am... D d moon Dancer. I talk her out of it. Because I would. Twilight, you can't leave. The, um, what? Do you? No. It was me. Oh, okay. I think it's Midnight Sparkle. She's still part of me. Uh, I, I Sunset's a, a, a psychic? The magic is infecting my friends. Twilight, there's no... She goes Avatar State. There's only you. How did you know And then she's really... When I touched your hand, I could see things. Nonchalant. I didn't understand why you were leaving. My new magic. This is my new magic. This is incredible. No, it's not. She that was playing it off like it was kind of just an everyday thing for a second there. This is a bad thing. Easy for you to say. Magic turned you into something beautiful. The last time I tried to use it, it turned me into a monster. Yeah, like a demon. I'm just so afraid it's gonna happen again. Yes, last time I turned into something amazing. A I phoenix. Magic turned me into a monster too. So if anyone understands what you're going through, it's me. I can help you, Twilight. I've and been the on. Most of our friends can be there for you too. Both sides of the coin. You run away. <sighs> I'll stay. But I still don't think it's a good idea for me to be near the rest of our friends right now. Hey. Not until we know why this is happening. Under Sunset's got this. What was that? Don't you worry. Ah! Oh. Wait. Ah! Twilight? Timber? Bacon hair? So it's just you. Wait, what are you doing now? SpongeBob. Here? With an axe. I was chopping down Not sacrificing school children that's that's not what i was doing campfire and if i didn't take care of it tonight it would be one more thing gloriosa would add to her list i've got this <laughs> what about you two why are on top you of hanging out in the woods spiking the kool-aid tomorrow oh i was sleepwalking twilight found me and was bringing me back to camp mm -hmm. oh on. someone i'll walk you guys back i'll protect you from 
Gaia ever free. Ever free. Oh god. I someone hit him with the axe, just Come on. That's obviously just a spooky story you made up to tell around the campfire. Oh no. It's Lucy. Sunset's How else would you trying to rival him dogs? for smoothness. Weird thing where the earth shook? Uh, come on. I know a shortcut back to the tents. Just sheer buttery smooth levels. Oh. Legit, huh? I think we just found our Gaia Everfree. But why would he work so hard to make us I think we just found our first clue. I don't know what he said about wishing his sister would sell this camp. If nobody wants to come here because it's home to some angry ancient nature spirit, it sure would help his cause. We should Okay. Not yet. That's logical. She's obviously going through a lot right now. We should probably be a hundred percent sure before we tell her the guy she However, is a jerk who's trying to run everybody out of camp. I had an inkling of a feeling that it might be him. But now because they think it's him, I'm gonna say it's not, and I'm I'm back to to Gloriosa. Uh you gonna give us a hand here, Rarity? I would love to. I really need to get the stitching on this poncho done if it's going to make it That was me clapping. Show. Though at the pace you two are moving, I don't know that I, I, I guess visual jokes don't the really translate that well. Our gift to the camp, and it's gonna get finished. That is, if Rainbow Dash would I love that me hammer. Bring me more wood. I can't go any faster. I'll bring you some wood. I'm end up in the woods again. Don't be silly. Really? <laughs> <sighs> I know I said I, we should I try bet that's a gift somewhere. Magic business, but I can't. What if I hammer the board into splinters? Uh -huh. That's that's a good. Oh, yeah. Shoot. I'm all out of nails. What if I hammer someone else into splinters? <laughs> good, it's a dud. What? Oh, do you think the nails would explode like the spring? <laughs> Wow. Sorry, girls. I can Pinky would be an effective soldier. I don't know how to control this? It's okay. Oh, none of us do. Turning anything into a grenade. This isn't happening. Do you have them now too? It started last night. When I touch people, it's like I can feel what they're feeling. <laughs> Tell me where you touch them, star, sunset, star, slim, glimmer, moon dancer. Oh my God. <laughs> what? That explains so much. <laughs> Girls, we can't just brush these powers aside because it doesn't yeah. seem like the ideal time to get yep. them. Well, All right. It turns out that they could actually make things better. You know, maybe the so only thing better than that. Oh, song. And it's not that. Great. Would have been if it just zoomed out to you, you to just someone watching, like Pinky watching television in the real world. I bet someone's made that, made a visual of something like that. Some giant meta joke. Alright. Oh! That accuracy! Good job! Oh! Five seconds! We've, we've doubled our productivity! Since the series started. Good job, guys. I say the magic. No more back, just let it out. I like this. The the duality between Sunset and, and Twilight's outlook on magic. Yeah. Because Sunset's been where Twilight's been. But she's also been redeemed. And that's... <laughs> yeah, suck it, bulk biceps. Oh no, Derpy! Oh god! Verity, watch out, you almost... cleaved Derpy in two! Things are gonna get R-rated really fast. So if you listen close, you might make a new friend. And together we... Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, the magic. All right. 
Yeah. All right, talking to the animals. And Applejack's really good at hammering. And Pinky's an explosives expert. Oh, Rarity has her, her runway. All right. Now we jump into the water because we ran out of out of walking space. Okay. That was pretty awesome. And look what you managed to accomplish. Yeah, we got a song on the soundtrack out of that. Please, please, please. Can we do a run through for the fashion show on it right this minute? Thought you weren't finished with the stitching on your poncho. I am now. <laughs> Get started without me. I gotta go find She was just Twilight. running that stitch See what through. What able to do here might make her embrace the new magic too. Uh, not that she has any. Smooth, Mrs. McSmooth over here. Ridiculous story. Ah, this is all too much for you. You have to let it go. I knew it. He wants her to get rid of. Let the it go. Camp. All right. <laughs> I don't know. I think Gloriosa might be the target here. What were you doing behind that door? What? Um. What? Me? No, I, nothing. Um, what door? Just an earring. Uh, there it is. Hey, listen. I gotta <laughs> run into you. I really wanted to thank you. That's like the the equal of pretending you have a phone call. Tough love. Telling me I should get over Twilight. I may have done that before. Sure. No problem. Is something wrong? What? No. Why? Come on, Sunset. We used to date. I know. Oh yeah. Uh, I forgot about that. Okay. Here's the deal. My friend really likes someone, but I don't think that someone is who she thinks they are. I don't want to upset my friend by telling her what I think because I also want to protect her because if what I think is happening is really happening, then she deserves to know. You know? No. Absolutely. But what I do know Do what is your heart your tells you. Is lucky to have someone like you to look out for them. Eat vegetables yeah. every day. Yeah. You know, you've changed a lot since we went out. You're so much oh nicer. Thanks. Less demonic. You noticed. Uh, look, maybe you and me, we could start over as oh, friends. Oh, Timber's uh, uh, bailing. Sounds great. I gotta go. Oh. Cool. Yeah, I want to start over later too. Oh, are. Uh, are we trying to make? <laughs> nice callback. Are we trying to make Flash a, a sympathetic character here? Like, are we maybe starting a a, a flash set ship? Cause I, I could I could work with that. Shoot, he's definitely up to something. Now, now this timber twilight thing, I I don't know. It's sunset. Oh, that was. He says to meet her by the rock quarry. I thought we weren't supposed to hike out that far. She says it's important. Is that a classical piece? Because I was thinking Castlevania at first, but I that's that's unlikely. What is that? Oh, ew, ew, ew. Get it off. I don't want that. Yeah, there we go. What's going on down there? I think it's Gaia Everfree. Or rather someone who wants us to think she's back. Come on. It's the It's the off limits place, what we said before. They told us not to go there, but they had a reason. This place is beautiful. And it wasn't any good reason. Equestrian magic here. I can... I can feel it. Wait. I thought Timber was just faking there was a magical nature creature. Are you saying it's real? Timber? Uh, what is he? This is real magic. This? Nothing. It's all me. Gasp! Oh, I... I it was Gloriosa all along. I was sure he was the one trying to make Oh my god, my guys, I never would have suspected. Who was trying to scare everyone away? I would never try to scare The the cheery camp counselor girl. Woman person. You fell behind on your payments, Gloriosa. I own the land now. Oh. Please, my great grandparents founded this place. It's been in our family for generations. You have to let the camp stay. Instead of filthy rich. A spa resort that will line my pockets with spa resort. more than this camp ever could. <laughs> I don't think so. So filthy rich is a villain here? I, I, I just need a little more time. Fine. 
Like he. I'll give you till the end of the month. <laughs> I mean, Pony Filthy Rich is kind of a cool guy. Like his wife oh, isn't, but <laughs> I don't think he would he would do that necessarily. Oh, oh, is that that's the that's the purple magic from the beginning of the of the movie, isn't it? It's all coming full circle. And she found the Chaos Gems, and now she's going... Super Gloriosa. Chaos Emeralds? Is that what they're called? I don't know what those things are. But I know what they can do! I've been practicing! I can control their power now! You don't know that for sure. I'm like Poison Ivy! Wait, we can't say that name because it's copyrighted. It's camp, and it's being taken away! If this has to be our last week here, I'm going to use whatever it takes to make it count! I got this! That's such a cute scene. I love that. Oh, man. It's, uh... No, yeah, th you're great. Good job. You, you have the magic under control. 100%. Using magic all <laughs> over the place. I had to tell them something to cover for you. What did you want me to do? I just wish you didn't tell them that ridiculous story. Ah, this is all too much. Yeah, because now they have to let it go. believe it's some supernatural thing instead of Dude me. He wasn't talking about letting go of the camp. I don't. He was talking about you letting go of the magical geo. I don't know what she's angry about that. All those things you were doing to make this week the best week ever. Every time you used magic to do them, it caused another problem. All right, we else. have seven. Timber was magical. Covering for you. Gems there. How do you know what I was doing with the geodes? How do you know about the magic? I can see things. Feel I have things. eyes. Because I have magic. Too. Special eyes. So she and so do we have seven friends. geodes. Gloria That's said. one for every main character. Fun. Maybe you should stop using magic. Too much of it can be dangerous if you can't control it. Oh, I got this. <laughs> I'm going to use it to I like save that. my camp. I just need more power. No! Maximum power. <laughs> Nano machine, son. Oh. Okay. All right. Sorry, girls. I know what I need. To this is it. This was in the trailer. I feel like we're not on the same page. So. You saw the from the back. You saw her from the back, and it, she looks different than Gaia. And that was what. It, okay. Got it. Got it. Oh man. I hope they watched Moana, so they can know how to get out of there. <laughs> Bonbon's like looking good, Fluttershy. Sunset. Oh, they're missing our dress. What is that raggedy end thing back there? I suppose we can get started without. Oh my God! Whenever you're ready. That is horrifying. That album cover had to be a an allusion to something. I told you you'd like it. It's all right, I guess. I do get to keep it after camp, though, right? That apple belt buckle, or whatever that is. I guess it's a belt. Pretty cool. I like it. Oh no. The forest is encroaching. She looks different. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she looks taller. <laughs> I'm into it. This is only a preview. <laughs> I've got another entire line I'll debut at the real thing. Um. <laughs> Why did you stop the <gasps> Why did you scratch that record, Miss Scratch? Attention, campers! It's Gaia Everfree! She's real! It's Gloriosa oh Everfree! Gloriosa? What are you doing? That's Gloriosa. Flying! Am I going crazy or her feet not touching the ground? Freaky dicky! <laughs> I have an announcement to make! That's Just good! Rich That's a good gag! Of camp ever free, but don't worry. I got this. <laughs> okay, I'm 
I'm really into that. I love that running joke now. At first, I was kind of iffy on it. Come on! We literally just finished building that! <laughs> oh man, all their hard work. Oh! Oh, villain song! Now the magic is my salvation. I'm in! Gather close in my protection. We all right. will stand forever free. Okay, all right. The forest is surrounding us. The beauty of nature in all its glory. No all its gloriosa. Vultures at the door. Someone consult the magic conch. <laughs> Celestia is about as effective as a human as she is as a pony. They have come into our domain. Oh. Timber. Seal our camp in chains. Use the axe on your sister. Generations. This is just a complicated. It's the only way. We'll stand All right. Free. All right. I like this. I love villain songs. Nature is our friend. I like the slowdown. This. This beauty that surrounds us. Every lovely bloom. Design. Like there's this fake purity going into the instrumental here. Come, just let them try. I'm not about to say goodbye. Followed by the the ramp up. Very epic. Forever free. All right. Hmm. Why do these kinds of things always happen? So everyone's trapped. What are we going to do? What we always do: save the day. Yeah. Kick butt and chew bubble gum. <laughs> Yeah. Make superhero capes. <laughs> <laughs> Enough about our wardrobe. Oh, come on, Rarity should have an outfit for every occasion on hand at all times. Like, oh no, oh no, OTP in trouble. Oh, they're doing the pony thing. Ugh. All right. Hi. Aww. Give us a hand, a, a paw. We could really use <laughs> Excuse me, I'm sorry. I'm not used to talking with with critters like you. I don't mean like you. I mean, but, who's not me? I, I mean, I don't. I don't have anything against you. I mean, I. I'm gonna stop talking now. That was a valiant effort on Applejack's part, at least. I I appreciate that. This is. Like, Chloreos is, like, not really being proactive right now. She's just kind of... watching and waiting. Oh no! Lyrabon! No weed's gonna... gonna get past an apple. This is a reminiscent of, like, Changelings. Just encapsulating everyone. Oh no, incoming! This isn't working! Man! Is too strong. These weeds are growing like weeds! Nice work, Spike. Good job, Spike. We finally found a use for you. Use your magic. I don't think I can lift something that big. It's our only chance of getting out of here and helping our friends. If only Applejack was here. All right. Wingardium Leviosa! <laughs> Good job. All right. Everyone's got their, their magic worked out. The sunset isn't very... 
useful against a villain like this. For you. <laughs> Florio, for you. Let's just think about this for a moment, shall we? I mean, I think Camp Everfree is absolutely delightful. Yeah, especially now. I'm quite ready to give up my weekly trips to the spa. <laughs> to the spa. <laughs> oh yeah, a filthy Rachel's gonna make a spa. You, you kind of, you really triggered her there, Rarity. This isn't the way. I appreciate your concern, Timber, but I got that. <laughs> yeah. Your concerns are noted. I will put them in my logbook. And we will deal with them in the six to eight weeks after they've been processed. Twilight, do you think you can use your magic? I don't think. I don't want to use too much. Midnight Sparkle could take over. I what? do. Our friends are in there. Okay. <laughs> well, you just grew ears, so I'm convinced. Please, Glorio. So when they grow the pony the ears, do they lose the human ears? Listen to me. That isn't Gloriosa. Because they got their hair like covering their ears mostly. That isn't your sister. I guess they do. Who's been consumed by equestrian magic? Whoever you are. Who's also your sister? Let my sister go. Please, Gloriosa, come back. I need you. Yeah, I don't think that works. Sorry, love's not gonna save the day here. This ain't Candlelight Wedding, buddy. Diamond Force Field. You can't keep this up forever. It's up to you. Oh, come on. You can use your magic to pull the brambles apart. No, there's too many of them. It would oh, take man. too much magic. I can't. It's the only way. You got you this. Embrace the magic inside you. You got this. What if she takes over? What if instead of saving everyone, I turn into Midnight Sparkle and only make things worse? That won't happen. Then we'll deal with you we afterward. If you turn to the Midnight Sparkle, it will take care of you personally. Don't worry. Come on, Twilight. You have to be stronger than she is. Oh, we're going full Alicorn. <laughs> oh, boy. You will never control me. I will always be a part of you. I feel like this is reminiscent of a, of a final boss in something. No! Oh, man. Twilight. Oh, all right. You are a light, darling. A force for good. Yeah. Yeah, you can kick the darkness's butt. Rainbow, they're dash for me. Twilight. And we'll be here no matter what. We believe We'll you. give you so many apples. You are not. Oh, I got <laughs> Everyone but Spike. Spike doesn't, no. doesn't matter. I am Twilight Sparkle. Yeah. The magic I carry inside me is. That's gonna get her like 400 points on the SAT. She knows her name. No! All right. Was that all we needed? Just a little levitating the gems away? At the shore. Oh man. Oh, now we're Sailor Mooning everything. Uh, is this Sergeant Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club land? Oh, jeez. We have, like, like, metallic steel wings. We could use those in combat. <laughs> Trixie is unamused. Being in the armpit of the large one. What happened? It's okay. You went full okay. demon. You never go full demon. <laughs> yep, all right. Our Beatles cover band is primed and ready to go. What? What are these? I'm not sure. 
but clearly we have some kind of connection to them. Like the, those, what they are. those shoulder plates are just gorgeous. preparing for oh, war. Totally go with the other collection I was working on for the camp fashion show. <laughs> That's probably canceled, isn't it? Oh my god. All right. I don't know. Whatever. It, they grew I'm clothes. So sorry. I'm okay with that, I guess. I only wanted this to be the best week Camp Everfree has ever had. And instead, I've made it the worst. What are you talking about? Maybe it's for the best that I'm losing the camp to fill. This was great. No, it's not. This camp has meant so much to so many people. My sister and yeah. me included. Why do you Aww. think we wanted our students to come here? We can't let Filthy Rich take this place away. If yeah. Is so much to you two, Someone so filthy. As much to the other campers who came and so rich. And should never maybe win. We can get them to help save it. Oh, like a fundraiser? Or a ball? Our band could play. More like a I fundraiser. Song just for the occasion. Oh, yeah. yeah, Fluttershy's got this. Those are all good ideas, but where would we hold it? We could hold it in the crystal cave. <gasps> sure. The crystal ball. <laughs> Crystal ponies. Enthusiasm. Really, I do, but I, I just don't know how we're going to plan a ball by tomorrow. But it's a cave party. We got this. <laughs> yeah. All right, cave party is a go. I used to think that Include the song. All right. Set in stone, concrete <laughs> lick, lick. Twilight, I'm running out of saliva. Keep licking! No other context is that okay to say. Yeah! Smooth! <laughs> I like Fluttershy. Her instrumental part is... is great. All right. Got new clothes. Oh, base fishing? Bass, base. Yeah, let's fish for base with Vital Scratch. Aw. Aw. Cute. <laughs> Great job, Pinky. Ooh. Fluttershy part. It's never boring in the sky. Rainbow is the best male male person. <laughs> yeah. Good job, Rarity. Professional chandelierist. These powers are so handy. Oh, oh, let's ship everything. See how many ships we can get. <laughs> Break it down, Bulk. All right, pillow fights. Yeah, all right. I like the chanting in this song. I can work with that. All right. Yeah, that was that was all right. It's a closer song. Thank you all so much for coming and for helping us raise enough money to save Camp Everfree. <laughs> like the pause, as if there was any other possible outcome. Uh, if I just asked for help in the first place, hey, enough money to it's kind of what we do. Buy a new car. Oh, Lyra Bonbon getting drunk. Not to brag or anything, but it's pretty cool how I saved all those campers from those Rupus fruticosis. <laughs> Blackberry brambles. Oh. Genus. It's just a little weird. You say you she, saved the campers. She's familiar with the genus, guys. Yeah, but I saved you from falling. Oh, did I say genus? You could save the campers. So technically, it was all me. Oh, this guy. I'm really glad I met you. Can we launch him? 
out the catapult uh -oh. yet. What? That sounds like a goodbye. Yep. And here I was hoping we'd still be able to hang out. I, I goodbye. Catch a movie. Goodbye sounds okay to me. We can goodbye yeah. all the way to. I really like that. Back oh, to school. Good. I was hoping that's what this meant. <laughs> no, I was just preparing to strangle you with the lights. Oh God. Oh God. Oh, uh, <laughs> sorry. I need to <laughs> there are some donors I really want him to meet. They were good friends with mom and dad. What is? What is even? That, I, Save me a dance, okay? That's farther than we ever got with Flash, isn't it? Adorable. He does seem like a pretty cool guy. They're just, they're just <laughs> trying to rile up the fans. Some new superpowers. <laughs> I had to know like 400 flyers. <laughs> Set up the stage. <laughs> and still had time to pick up pizza. I love yeah. super speed. That's the most important <laughs> thing. I think the crystals are the source of the superpowers. Well, you're not going to ask us to give them up. Yeah, there are seven of them, so... No. In fact, I think maybe we were meant to have them all along. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> you're just saying that because it gives you superpowers. I think we were meant to have these abilities. Just saying. Oh, Sunset's eyebrow game. There is one thing I'm still wondering Trying to about. give Applejack a run for her money. Where did the magic that hit this cave come from? Oh, we're gonna zoom over to like the actual Gaia Everfree, like one of those spooky. Uh, oh, oh no, that's the. Oh, oh, that's the portal. That's the portal to Equestria. I think they just teased the sequels at us. You, you sequel baiters. They're masters at that. All right. Oh, and another song. Fish Hook, Tara Strong, Rebecca, Ashley, Andrea, Tabitha, Kathy, and Need, Brian. Good job, guys. Sandalwood. Who's that? Vincent Tonga. Sandalwood. Yep. All right. Cool stuff. Oh, oh, they burned the. Cutie marks into the wood. That's good stuff. Legend of Everfree, intro song. Midnight and Me, that was a good one. Embrace the Magic, I like that one. Yeah, overall, the songs here, they were they were cool, they were fine. I don't know if they really had as much impact on me as, as the last couple movies. Uh, definitely not Rainbow Rocks, because the sirens still knocked it out of the park. I still know, like, I don't know. They're still good. They're fine songs. In terms of villain songs, I think we've had better. And nothing was quite, on, on terms of group songs, I don't think anything quite hit. Akadeka. Or, uh, that one main six song they put out between uh, Rainbow Rocks and Friendship Games. I can't remember the name of it. The one where Applejack was riding a horse at one point. And Twilight was on the piano. That was great. Yeah, Sunbutt. On the wood. That was cool movie. Oh, Moonbutt. Making her appearance. Yeah. This is cool. I like this movie. This was fine. Oh, is that Twilight and, and, and McSmooth? Oh boy, I don't... That's just a, a mess. That is a powder keg ready to explode. Oh, thank you to the British Columbia Production Services Tax Credit. Uh, province of British Columbia, rather. I apologize. Third time's the charm! Oh. Or is it fifth? I've lost track. I can't count. The runway is finished. I think you mean the dock. Oh, I think you mean complete. Wait. Let's celebrate! Wait. Oh no. <laughs> oh, the poor dock. They can't catch a break. That was cute. I like. That was a good outro. That was a, a good... Closer right there.
Not it wasn't a tease for another movie. It was just a a cute little thing. Oh wow. Okay, that was that was fun. That was fun. I liked it. It was it was paced well. Didn't have any like super jarring like story moments or or weird weird character moments. Um, I have to have a little bit of time to go back over this uh, before you know I make my more solid opinions here. But let's jump to the outro then. All right, guys, that was Equestria Girls Four: Legend of Everfree. And that was a completely fine EQG movie. On the whole, I would probably put it third in the series after Rainbow Rocks and Friendship Games. I probably have less issues with it than with the third movie, but that's more a byproduct, I think, that the story was less ambitious. That is, things felt a bit smaller in scope, maybe a little less important to the main plot. That may be a little unfair because there are long-term ramifications of them now having superpowers, effectively. And we did make strides in helping Twilight overcome her demons, but in effect, this is the second time in a row where the conflict was driven by her own insecurities, so hopefully this is the last time I would not want to see a third iteration of that. But even though I don't think there was as much of a driving force here, as, say, the introduction of the human world, or the Sirens and Sunset's Redemption, or the introduction of Human Twilight Sparkle and Midnight Sparkle, this was handled well. The writing was solid, the characterizations were on point, the humor was good, both in terms of visual gags and character moments, the songs were fine, I don't think I enjoyed them quite as much as the last two movie soundtracks, especially not Rainbow Rocks. But we did have a solid villain song, a really nice solo performance from Twilight, and a couple catchy tunes from the ensemble cast. The story was fairly predictable, but not annoyingly so, and they threw in some red herrings, I appreciate that. It's nice that there weren't any real villains. Sure, Filthy Rich is a jerk, but he's not evil here. The pacing, I would say, was better than the first or the third movies. They did not try to cram quite as much into 70 minutes, so it all flowed well. It was smooth, almost as smooth as Mr. McSmooth himself, Timber Spruce. Does the fandom hate him quite as much as they did Flash from the first movie? Because I, I kind of like him, honestly. After a while, he's a total dweeb. And it's kind of okay because the person he's hitting on is not the real Twilight Sparkle that we know and love. And the movie is shipping them hard. They gave Flash a, a canoe in the first film, but they gave Mr. Smooth a yacht to go out with Twilight on in this one. Speaking of Brad, I totally like the guy at this point. He's really pitiful. In all honesty, he has progressively gotten better since the first movie. Like, I would not ship him with Twilight, per se, but he can have Sunset for all I care. She's expendable. Twilight and Sunset were well done here, and the rest of the main six got some good lines in. They're still kind of shoehorned off to the side a little bit, but I don't know. That's kind of the way this series has always been. Overall, this was, it was good. It was entertaining. It was enjoyable. A nice field trip, a little bit of Scooby-Doo, a little bit of Jekyll and Hyde, a clear setup for sequel material that they have plenty of room to work with. Magic is leaking out of Equestria. Maybe we'll see ponies again at some point, because we definitely did not see any here. It seems like they're really trying to separate the two franchises, and it's working, I guess. So yeah, Equestria Girls is more settled into itself, it's more comfortable, and that gives me fewer things to say about this one than the previous films when they came out. There aren't as many world-shaping events, I have fewer opinions on, on what's happening. Or rather, maybe I have opinions, but this film did nothing to change them. Either way, I do look forward to seeing what happens next in this series. EQG has successfully diverged, and it can tell us new and interesting stories. Until that happens, thanks for watching everyone. And remember, I got this.